Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, I was reading some wrestling news earlier today and I read an article that I did not enjoy. Paige responds to fan criticism on her Twitter or whatever the fuck there. Um, basically, some fan wrote, um, I miss the days when you had good matches, blah, blah, blah. And pretty much her matches today aren't as good as what they used to be. And I agree with that guy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? She replies with, Why would I care about the opinion of a stranger? And you don't know anything about the wrestling business. The usual pathetic bullshit wrestler excuses. The pathetic fucking cop-out that every dumbass wrestler uses when they're met with a fucking valid statement or argument. First of all, it is fucking true. It is the truth that her fucking matches were better in the past. She used to have big matches, you know what I'm saying, on NXT. Even on Raw, she'd have better matches. Nowadays, it's two-minute, boring, throwaway, piece-of-shit garbage matches that nobody gives a flying fuck about. You understand? The guy has a valid fucking statement there. And she replies with, You're a stranger. What the fuck is this? What the fuck kind of dumbass retarded logic is this there? Oh, this hat isn't blue. It's yellow. This is a yellow hat. And if you tell me that I'm wrong, it doesn't matter. Because you're a stranger. What the fuck? Is she 10 years old, this fucking moron, or what? You, you say a valid statement, a valid fucking point to her. No! You're a stranger! Fucking shit! Imagine using this there in a debate. You watch a political debate. Somebody tells a valid statement, a valid critique to Donald Trump, and he responds with, You're a stranger! So, so your argument is invalid. Is this bitch fucking stupid or what, dear? You're, you're a stranger, so... What you say doesn't matter. What the fuck is that shit? A new fucking low for wrestlers, this stranger cop out there. And then she says, you don't know anything about the wrestling business. The usual fucking bullshit cop out that all these dumbass wrestlers use all the time there. And that shit makes me fucking sick. This guy... The guy that, that said this, he's saying something legit. You don't need to be backstage to know that her fucking matches were better in the past. You see a 20-minute match packed with wrestling, submissions, big dangerous moves. All her matches on NXT packed with good wrestling. The shit that made her popular in the first place, you know. Then you look at two-minute, throw-away, fucking pathetic matches on Raw. You don't have to be backstage to see that the old matches were better. It, it, it's a fucking valid, straight-up, fucking truthful statement there. Oh, and you're not in the business. Fuck you. Fuck you, you dumbass motherfucking tramp. I am sick of these wrestlers thinking that they're better than everybody just because they're wrestlers and we're not. Any type of valid fucking criticism. No, you're not backstage, buddy. <laughs> you're wrong about everything because you're not a gay fucking wrestler in tights who pretends to fucking fight. These guys, because they, they have oil on their body, tights, and they fake fight, apparently, 
they're better than everybody and they're above criticism and they can counter any fucking argument simply by saying that you're not backstage. I call fucking bullshit on that fucking crap. Imagine if I worked at McDonald's and I made a sandwich that tasted exactly like shit. Imagine you come to me at McDonald's, I, I give you a sandwich that literally tastes like shit. You're gonna complain. Imagine coming to me to complain after eating a shit-tasting sandwich. And I say, oh, your complaint is, isn't valid, buddy, because you're not in the McDonald's business. You don't have a right to complain because you're not in the restaurant business, pal. Fuck off. Fuck off. That, that wouldn't make sense anywhere in the fucking world. But these cocksuckers think they can avoid fucking truth and facts and valid fucking statements simply by using cop-out bullshit about how we're not backstage. Fuck your fucking stupid face, you dumb fucking bitch. I fucking hate that shit. I straight up hate that fucking shit. Fuck your face, you dumbass fucking pale fucking skin tramp. You dumbass motherfucker. Imagine that in the debate there. Donald Trump, oh, you're a stranger. You're not in the McDonald business, so you're wrong there, Jeb Bush or whoever the fuck there. What a bunch of fucking idiots. Fuck you, Paige. Your matches do fucking suck. Your matches were better in the past. And that guy on Twitter said the fucking truth about you. Fuck you and your bad fucking pathetic debate skills, you stupid bitch. Go fuck yourself. Until next time, peace.